Okay, it's 212. It's time to call the meeting of the Utilities, Co Utilities Committee to order. Mr. Frank, what kind of business do we have today? Roger. So, um, just to recap everybody's memory, shortly after I started, actually right at the beginning of COVID, um, the rates had already increased and there was a three-year plan to increase uh, sewer rates gradually to cover the payments from the sewer plan. The latest increase was should have been this past uh, July 1st for 8%. So to recap, we actually raised 8% last in 2021 or 2020 at summertime in 2020, we went up 8%. Then in January of 21, we went up 8%. And it was supposed to be 8% again uh, the 23rd or the July of 21. However, there was a lot of other stuff happening and then that was missed. So we recalculated and going, we don't necessarily need to double for January 1st, 22. So we don't need to do 16%, but we do need to do 10% to make up for the lost ground that we have in the last six months. I fully understand that. If there's any questions, people can contact us, the manager or any of us by email. Um, but this has been part of the projected plan all along. We just missed the update. So I have no problem getting that. Right, correct. And I just want to reiterate that so these these in, continuous increases aren't going to be the same high amount. So as, as the years go on, uh, our schedule actually decreased. You know, there'll still be a slight increase, but not as much. So we're taking the brunt of it in the very beginning, and then it'll start to decline after that. But uh, there will, will always be an increase. We have to do that to keep up the infrastructure and to keep up the inflation in the times. So it, it doesn't do anybody any injustice, whatever. You go 20 years without raising rates, and then all of a sudden you need a big raise rate, and then it's like we're bad guys. So we're just trying to keep up with it. Thanks, GS. Yes. Um, anyway, um, yes. No, to piggyback, cool. we do want to get to the point where it's just uh, inflation rates. Yes. Is only. yes. Um, Taylor told me that the water fund's pretty good, so the only water increase should be two or three percent, whatever the national inflation was. So there's not going to be a significant height in any water rates either. So okay. that's good. All right, well, I am, I'm good. I'm good too. I don't have a problem taking that to full vote of council. You can uh, send it to next meeting. Okay, we'll do. All right, anything else? My last thing, just for the record of public at home, so they're aware, um, I, I talked to some of you. So the lift station directly behind us at the BFW, over the last. Same, same problem I brought up in the council meeting. It's gotten worse. The problems have. Yeah, we never got out of that meeting. No, we have blown up. No. <laughs> the uh, it's continued to get worse. Um, right now, I think we're on hour twenty five without it breaking, which is a record in the last few weeks. Is that about right? It's pumping right now. Um, the our the vault our cap in the vault seems to be leaking. The vault is full. Yeah, but the wet well is pumping down like it's supposed to. So with all that said, we submitted a package today to um, the Ohio Public Works Commission for emergency funding to replace that. It's uh, roughly $250,000. As far as I can tell, there's no copay and match that the city's on the hook for, but that will fix one of our biggest problem children when it comes to lift stations in the city. And uh, when I believe they've engineered it too to accommodate the rags that we're getting. Mm -hmm. We also are working on some other solutions to catch those upstream as well. Yes. So just that's the update. Well, hopefully by Monday council meeting, I'll have a yay or a nay if we got the money. Well, I, we appreciate everyone's hard work on that. And I have seen I have seen the photos of the rags and of the, of the pillows. And the last one I saw had Raymond noodle containers floating around in it. Well, I tell you, but there's usually only one place where that comes from. So uh, we do appreciate everyone's uh, continuous um, efforts to keep that station running. So we do thank you. That's all I have. That's all I got. Okay. Uh, meeting adjourned on uh, at 2.16.